Hi there, and welcome to everything you need to know about Maya 2025. Discover top highlights in Maya, from animation, modeling, and simulation, to open technologies like LookDevX and Maya USD. Starting with animation, the Dope Sheet Editor has been completely redesigned, allowing animators to manage large-scale animation changes more effectively. Along with a customizable color palette to visually distinguish different sets of keys, the new Dope Sheet Editor debuts a custom channel sets feature, meaning you can now create sets of commonly used animation controls which you can easily flip between without having to touch the viewport. This update also introduces a new Deformer Manager to the Attribute Editor for deformed objects. You can now quickly access all important information, manage each Deformer and Topology modifier affecting an object, and reorder Deformers, saving you time so you can focus on ideating and creating. You can find new and faster motion trail tools, such as different draw styles and modes, in a new single location, the Motion Trail Editor, which is in the Visualize menu or on the animation shelf. For all the modelers out there, the Smart Extrude tool, originally introduced in 3ds Max, is now available in Maya, bringing you the Extrude tool you have always wanted but never had. Smart Extrude allows you to extrude faces on a mesh in a flexible and predictable way minimizing manual cleanup of resulting geometry. And for zero friction modeling, the bevel node can now filter input edges in multiple ways, such as selected edges, hard edges, or edges by angle or filter angle. And bevel now works with Boolean objects. If you adjust the input meshes in the Boolean node, the bevel will automatically update, affecting only the new intersection edges as they change. Bifrost Ocean Simulation System, also known as BOSS, is integrated into the Bifrost graph as an updated modular design, supporting 2D foam simulations and geometry displacement for waves. Included Bifrost browser examples get you up and running quickly. They demonstrate a procedural ocean tool ready for you to customize and deploy across your production. And in-graph liquid meshing tools are now in the Bifrost graph. This modular compound is designed to work with imported BIF caches from Bifrost liquids in Maya. For LookDev artists, the latest update to LookDev X, integrated with OpenUSD, introduces an exciting new feature. Support for the native Material X data model. You can now import, export, and edit Material X files and assign Material X materials directly to Maya geometry. Additionally, you can easily start the Material X workflow by choosing the data model from the Start screen or the Graph tab. Other exciting changes are new automatic data structures when creating Material X materials. For better file I.O. workflows, like Material X Stack and Material X Document. Speaking of OpenUSD, its integration continues to get stronger with a new update, bringing the ability to load or unload multiple prims simultaneously and use the universal manipulator for prim manipulation. And when you are ready to render your creations, an overhaul GPU renderer in Arnold brings important improvements in startup time and rendering speed. To see the full list of new features and improvements, you can check out our What's New in Maya page, linked in the description. And for more videos like these, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Thanks for watching.